Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Goalie Be a Pro. We're on episode... I... I've lost count. To be honest, I don't know where we are. I think this will be 28. This was going to be our final year until we were held against our will by the Edmonton Oilers. So we'll see what happens. Maybe we'll do another one. Maybe we won't. But right now we have the Avs in round number two of the 2027 Stanley Cup playoffs. We can do a quick rundown of the lines again. We have Laugh, Borgo, and Marner, Kane, Holloway, Yams, and Nuge, who not doing great, I feel like. Let's have a look. Is he doing any better? No, <laughs> he is not doing any better. Defensively, we are pretty solid all around. Scratched, we have Lambert for who knows what reason. And in net, yours truly. 93 overall, not too shabby. Let's see how the sim engine treats us today. It is a best of five series here. Our first game on the road against the Avs. You know, that high latitude or whatever it's called. I feel like for some reason, Denver is just very high up and there's something about the oxygen. I don't know if that's you know, totally legit or not, but I've heard it. I mean, it does make sense, but is it really that much higher than everywhere else? Maybe it is. Could be. It's called the Mile High City for a reason. First period. Nice. Second period. Ooh, hoo -hoo. lovely. Let's jump on in and hopefully not screw this up. Is Colorado the only team that made both of their reverse retro jerseys white? I'm trying to run through the teams in my head here. But that's, you know, not going to do a whole lot. In the middle of the Landis Cog. And in the mid. Ah! I gave it away. Oh, no. They're going to score off of that, aren't they? I should not have passed that out. Complete rookie mistake. But the boys are here to back me up. Thank you, Laffy Taffy. Marnsey's in. Drops it off to Nurse. What passing. And holy, what a start to this third. We have been flying. That goal was bound to happen eventually. Because the puck movement, the intensity, everything that we have come into this third period with has been positive. I think we're going to be... I, it's early, alright? Don't get me wrong. It's still very early in this game, but I think we're going to be up 2-1. Also, on a side note, six saves, Stewie. Yeah, as a unit, we're just playing too good. Something monumental is going to have to happen for this to completely shift... Are you kidding me? Dylan Holloway going to bury it off of... I. They passed it out, right? Goalie passed it out. Which... <laughs> Stewie! What are you doing, buddy? Let's have a look here. Yeah, makes a glove save. Decides he's going to yeet it. And Holloway is there to bury on the doorstep. Not the greatest pass from Stewart. Can't lie. Ooh, that's a big shot. The rebound as well will be saved. I had the angle completely cut off. If they passed it into the middle, I was SOL. No shot I was getting over for that. But I think I completely took off the angle that even if they wanted to try passing, wasn't going to work. Robin Leonard's in that, first of all. What a save. We are living rent-free in Stewie's head. And I'll tell you one thing right now. Real estate ain't cheap, so rent-free is pretty good. Nice try by Andre. Okay, how'd that get back there? Cue of the day. Because it looked like I had the entire angle cut off there, but apparently it found a way behind me. Luckily, we fell on it. <laughs> Andrew Kopp goes across to Turbo. Makes a move, gets by the defender with relative ease. But not that defender. Lilligren all up in his face. Not allowing... Any movement whatsoever, really. Like, he just got right in there. Personal bubble was invaded. Landis Cog. Oh, can I make it into a save? Ah, oh, come on. You could have just kicked it away. Chalked another one up. Whatever. It is what it is. I can't really complain because look at the score. That's all I'm going to say. Not going to say shut out because why would I say that? Landy making some fancy moves. I slid behind the net. The theatrics of it all. I need to see that again. Landis Cog thinks he's so clever walking out, trying to go up close. I headbutt the post. Well, reverse headbutt the crossbar. So literally nothing I said was true. Reverse headbutt the crossbar. It goes behind. <laughs> Look at it. It's so dramatic. Goes along the line. 
Holloway's like, yeah, that's all you, bud. And then we just smack it away. What a thing of beauty. I can't pass up on prime thumbnail opportunities, so there you go. Oh wait, no, the ring is still there. Get rid of that. Listen, I have no idea what our coach said before this game or what's been going on the last two, but we are playing on a different level here today. I have never seen the lads this desperate for a dub. And I'm so down. Like, let's keep it up. Borco almost gets another one. O'Reilly has it. That will be stopped. Riskily. <laughs> That's not a word, is it? Riskily. I don't think so, but if not, I'm going to say that I just invented it. I riskily passed out the puck. That was so bad on my part. Absolutely horrendous. The positioning on that first save was not good. And then I just let the puck fall right in front of me. Whatever. It's 4 1. Get over yourselves, Colorado. Our second line has been the most wild. Every time their skates touch the ice, we generate all kinds of chances. So props to them. Yeah, right, Turbo. Not going to score that easily. In front it goes again. Landis Cog tries to rip one, fails. Back to the point. Walker goes across to Girard, who takes a shot. Steered aside. Over to Lilligren. Battle ensues. Pool party. Dishes it off to Nuge. The no-look pass was perfection. 20 seconds to go. Can we get another one? We sure can. Ratcliffe on the doorstep picks up the rebound. I'm so glad we got that, actually, because that's just the extra kick. While they're down right now. It's 4-1. And... We're not letting up. Stewie might come out flying next game, so... Gotta be on the lookout for that. I just have a feeling Mans is gonna have a bounce back game. Hopefully not, though. Hopefully he stays Swiss cheese. That would be perfect for us. 35 shots, only one goal against. I gotta be first star. Come on. I know we got five goals, but let's be real here. A 34 save, one goal against performance has to be star numero uno. You're delaying it, thank you. Yeah, 971. Is that good? It is good. By the way, in case you didn't know. 221 GAA, 921 save percentage. Now that I'm highlighting this, we are about to get wrecked. 2-1 lead over Colorado. That is not the showing they wanted for their first home game in round number two. Let's see if we can absolutely dummy them again in front of their home crowd. First period, we take that. Second period, oh yeah. Here we go. This game is huge. If we win, we're up 3-1, which is a very nice spot to be. I can't lie. So let's get it done here. Borgo tries to get his own rebound. Is it? It is Skinner back in net. I can tell. Number 74. He's two off of being the best number in the game. So close, Stuart, yet so far. Nice hit. Not really, actually. <laughs> Thought there was going to be a little more behind that one. It ended up being sort of just a stand-up, I guess. Maybe let up, you know? We are beating them 3-1. This is going to potentially be a 3-1 series. But if that is the case, I'm not happy. We can't let up because if you give them an inch, they're going to take a mile. we got to stay on top of them. Keep your foot on the gas pedal. Nice play. Good stop by Stewie, though. I'll give him that. Another good stop. Again, our team is just outrageous right now. I don't know what happened. I really don't know why we are playing in such a manner, seemingly out of nowhere. And I love it. No, Landis Cog takes it. Ooh, big hit in the slot. For what? For interference. Give me a break. I need to see the replay. Maybe there was like another player in the way and kind of hit them both, which is a joke by the way if that's what happened sick replay oh there we go yeah i guess it was just crossfire essentially nice try kale pass that out to nurse makes a play instead of sending it down the ice still don't understand why that's a thing we're short-handed guys in case you didn't know not for much longer apparently though nice well that's a good easy way to kill off a penalty Four on four action. Great defensive play, Brett. Get the twig in the lane. Not allow them to 
to have those up close opportunities. I would say that I could handle the ones from far out, but those kind of seem to be my weakness, actually. They take a shot and then get a rebound or something. Or I just have horrible positioning like I did there. Although that time I still managed to make the stop. They go down low. Hayes has it. The man who just ruined their power play. It's all up in front of the net. I am... You know what? Why did I do that? Why did I do that? <laughs> I don't know why I do this to myself. But it didn't result in a goal somehow. By an absolute miracle on ice. They did not score. That was all the defensemen. Because Giryanov left my jockstrap somewhere back in Edmonton. Cop goes to Landeskog. Oh my word, my positioning was not good there either. I feel like I'm getting really blessed by our 93 overall. Plus, I guess our X-Factors and abilities. Because a lot of the time, I feel like my positioning is horrible and I shouldn't be making the saves that I am. If we were back in the CHL and I was like 25 overall, then these saves would not be happening. What's going on? That was weird. I never really looked at the shot, so I don't know what either team has, but I do gotta say that both goalies have been closing the door in this third period. Free team play. Don't mind if I do. Can I just stay here as long as I want? Nope, he's coming after me. <laughs> I could kill some time by doing that though. Become the league villain. Edmonton holding me here against my will is our villain origin story. You either die a hero or live long enough to see yourself become a villain. Timothy Jimothy is about to go through the ringer here. Glove save. Pass it out to Lilligren. Okay, we are one win away from the conference finals. 3-1 series lead over the Avs. Will we close it out in this video? Suppose we'll find out. Shots were 37 to 18. So we double plus one to them. Both goalies did well. Gotta say, I tip my cap to you, Stuart. We're back at home. I still feel like they haven't fixed the whole mask thing. Yeah, no, you can only pick standard masks still. There's no team masks. Well, that sucks. It's a new day. Yes, it is. I don't really know how I feel about this. I kind of like it. Should have just went full orange everything. But anyway, we're gonna jump in here. Sim game. We could move on to the conference finals if all goes well. But I don't think Colorado's going down that easy. First period. 1-1. One, one. Pool party in Palat. Second period. Okay, well then. Yeah, I would say that I was correct. They are not going down without a fight. The way we've been buzzing, I wouldn't rule this out as a loss just yet. It's not looking good, but I feel like we still stand a sliver of a chance. Like, look at that. Already. That was almost two goals. It was not two goals, to be fair. Hockey is not a sport of almosts. We do have to actually achieve even with a loss here we are still sitting in a good spot with a 3-2 series lead they would have to win two more in a row that pass would have been magnificent if it was just one or two seconds earlier andrew cop trying to get by the defender will not succeed in his journey nurse gets it to pesci here we go down the ice we got to get one quick if we do want to win and send colorado home then i mean we gotta really do something soon here because time is going to become our enemy real fast or go is he also a baseball player or what's up what a hit helmet off and all that could be the momentum change we needed he skated right to the bench too he's not feeling too good after that one come out and get the team play around the boards to yams and that makes it cross ice to pesci we are loving the dump and chase in this third period. What is that angle? Hello? How did he end up scoring that? Did it go under the blocker? Because I feel like I had that whole thing cornered off. But let's see. Let's not see. The pass goes over. Fluffs the shot. And then I'm right there for it. Oh, did he just get it off before I got there? Yep. Okay, fair enough. The Avs were kind enough to give us a power play. 
I don't know. The intensity that we had over the last two games is just not there. That's the post. The next closest thing to scoring a goal. My team play is going to be through the roof at this point. They just keep sending it down the ice. Which is surprising. Because normally they don't. All of a sudden. They're up by four goals. And they decide, yeah, let's dump it down the ice immediately. That's an easy save. I feel like this coming up will not be as easy. Gerard gets it to Landis Cog. Another one. Bites the dust. We just have to move on. Get out of here quick and forget about this game. Oh no! Thank you, Timothy. From one Timothy to another, I appreciate it. They're back at it. In front. I am way out of the net on that save. That was weird. I guess probably had to jump on the puck. The rebound. To make sure that we did, in fact, control it. Came behind the net. Nice try. Five minutes ago. Yeah, this is basically done. If there's one thing we have been doing well in this third period, it's throwing the body around. We've made many big hits and a couple of their players had to limp off. So at least we got the physicality aspect on point. Whoa. Oh my. Turbo got Beybladed and someone's just holding out their stick for him. Like, yeah, you're good, dude. Just stay out there. Here's my stick. Turbo actually did stay out. Mad lad. Giryanov is in. Defender will catch him, though, and he's going to miss the net horribly. 1.2 seconds to go. This game was not it, Chief. Yeah, you should be disappointed. Horrendous performance. Kane has 9 points in 12 games. Same with Marner and Laugh. That's not enough. We got to do better. Pool party, Nuge, and Yams with 7. Okay, so... Nuge kind of brought it back. That last performance dropped us by 0 .06. So we now have a 915-233 GAA. The Mighty Ducks of Anaheim and the Ottawa Senators swept their series. So we are waiting on the New Yorks and us. Really don't want another Game 7. So hopefully we can close it out to start the next video. But... I just, I don't know. Colorado seems to be clawing their way back. I feel like we are going to have another game seven. But again, hopefully not. Well, anyway, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Subscribe and your favorite team will make a good trade. I'll see you soon.